Hello guys, Career 438 here. Um, today I got another opening for you guys. It's still Christmas, by the way, the same day I record that Dual Store Alliance opening. But anyway, today I got Legendary Collection 5Ds. I also got this for Christmas. And let's just read the back. Let's rev it up. Um, take a trip back to the turbo dueling years when your deck was only as good as your dual runner. Uh, there were no dual runners and the dual runners don't exist. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Legendary Collection 5Ds takes you to the finish line with the most exciting cards from Yusei, Jack, Crow, and Akiza, plus the menacing monsters of their great enemies. So you get five legendary collection, five of these mega packs, and one double sided game board. Every mega pack has nine cards. And you have five these rare, one secret rare, one ultra rare, one super rare, one rare, and five common cards per pack. Over 250 cards to collect from that set. It is is no legendary collection three Yogi's World though, which had over 300 cards. Joe's World was like, was like two cards short, I think. Uh, it also includes, oh yeah, but, but guys, those, those sets aren't good anyways, so we just shun those. Um, two Ultra Rares, syn two Ultra Rares, Ultra Rares Dragon Synchros, two of the most powerful and popular Synchro monsters ever created. Shooting Quasar Dragon and Black Rose also include three new Ultra Rare cards. Three new cards seen before only on the TV show. So that's pretty cool. Got that Quasar on the front. They stopped doing the thing. Well, I mean, we know they stopped doing that. It was since like Joey's World where they stopped putting the cards on like the front. And now they come in the packs. Oh my gosh, guys. Did I get cheated out of Quasar? I don't think I did. No, I, I didn't, guys. There are five cards in this thing. Okay, so I'll showcase the promos. I wanted to get two of these, but I went easy. I went easy on the. I decided to go easy on the money this year and not do that. So yeah. So we got Jorman Dog, Jorman Dargar, the Nor the Nordic Serpent, Fenrir, the Nordic Wolf, Stardust Flash, which is actually kind of a cool card. You get to target one Stardust monster in your graveyard, special summon it. And we got, we got what we actually came for, guys. You get the guarantee, all these cards are guaranteed along with Black Rose Dragon and Shooting Quasar Dragon. These are <coughs> the ones you're looking for. None of these guys, no, you can just toss those out the window if you want. Those are like four bucks each. But these, I mean, these probably won't get you any, get you a lot of money, but, you know, they're pretty good. Black Rose, I mean, it's a field nuker. Quasar, you get to make Quasar decks with them. Also, Necroz. So yeah, look forward to that. So, we're going to put uh, the big bucks over here. I mean, they're not really worth that much money, but you know. Um, we're going to put our Ultra Rares over here, of course. These guys have to go on the top, guys, because they're what... They're the promos that we came for. Also, under this, check it out. It's a mat. No, actually, I don't think I've actually seen this. It has um, Yusei, Luna, Leo, Crow, Jack, and Akiza on it. And Legend of Collection 5 Ds on the back. It's got the Nordic monsters. Odin. Um, Thor, I don't know if I was playing, yeah, and Loki, there, and some Earthbound Immortals. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Up. Oh, they don't put the things on here. They let you loose, I guess, guys. Okay, well, I, I like, I don't, I've never really, I've never played Nordics, personally. Also, I think they should have given you the, like, 
pendulum board. I don't know how it would have worked that out though. Okay, well, anyway though. Here are our five packs, guys. Now, there are some pretty cool cards in the set. This, this set is actually not complete garbage at this point in time, unlike the other, unlike all the other Legendary Collections. Well, I mean, Legendary Collection 2 at least has hero stuff. But, I mean, we're getting an entire hero structure, which, you know, probably has all the... All the ones you really need, like Bubble Man and Neos Alias, all those guys. So, <clears throat> this set has, you know, I mean, you got your Signer Dragons, Stardust, Black Roses in this set, weirdly enough, even though it's a, already a promo. It's like Bugente Susawano, the Susano, I mean, being a promo and then also being in the in like the actual mega packs I found that a little weird how they did that um there's I mean Red Dragon Archfiend is not good but I mean it's okay I guess to pull I'm not gonna look for it I, I don't, I'm not gonna want it but you know um there's also <coughs> Ancient Fairy Dragon and which we don't want either, but, you know. Uh, Power Tool Dragon, we also don't want that. Also, every Cyander Dragon except Black Rose comes in either Ultra Rare or Common. So that's kind of cool. Uh, but, but the real card that we're looking for, guys, is, you guessed it, Vanity's Emptiness. Debunk and Full House are also in here, but... I mean, we we don't really want, we're not really looking for those, per se. It would be cool to get them, especially because my super rare deer bunks, like, well, I mean, it's already too late, but, you know, spent like $50 on those two, $59 on those two debunks. And we can't get it back now, guys. But, anyway. Yeah, those cards run. Those two cards are not really looking for, but it will be cool to get them, just cause like trades, you know. But anyway, yeah, the really the really good card that we're looking for is Vanity's Emptiness. That is the reason I bought the set because I wanted that card, and because it's a real money card. All right, so also it didn't get hit by the ban list, so yeah, we're going to start. I'm right handed, so we'll start with the right. Go from right to left. Alright, let's open these packs. Gotta do this quickly, too. I only have like 10 minutes left. Tuning, Changing Destiny, Supe, Naturia Beast, nice. Gold, Fa Gold Fox, Nordic Beasts, Mechloid Emperor, Granol, Clock Resonator, Vice Dragon, Battle Waltz. Oh, I didn't realize how far. Yeah, it should be like right there. The Churia Beast, though. Beast and Barkion are also in the set, so. If you want to go uh, old style side against Cleves, then by all means. I don't see why you'd waste two side deck cards though, just to do that. I, I, I don't know. Maybe maybe it's really useful, but personally, I don't want to try it. I prefer triple spell shattering arrow and triple fairy wind. Also, because what do, what do you do if they flip vanity? Yeah, red carpet, turbo synchron, Lujol self of the Nordic elf air. Oh, spoilers! Rose tentacles, magic planter. Uh, and those ninjas and such. Thor, Lord of Azir, Junk Berserker, Junk Defender, March Towards Ragnarok. So remember guys, we're searching for Vanity's Emptiness. Eh, jeez. I 
Actually, I kind of wonder how much Centuria Beast sells for. Probably not that much. Because... One Earth Tuner, one more non-tuner Earth Monsters. Hint, hint, you know. But anyway, let's do it. Offering to the Immortals. Speed Warrior. Effect Veiler. I forgot that's that. I forgot that that was in here. Common. Oh yeah, and Maxi's in here, guys. So that's pretty cool. Driven Daredevil. Saval, Savar Tal for the Nordic Alphair. Loki, Lord Azir. Earthbound Immortal Yuru. Resonator Engine. Blackwing. Kogarashi, the Wanderer. Oh yeah, and there's Blackwing cards in here, but I'm not gonna look for those. I don't even want to make Blackwings. I don't even like black wings. I hate that deck. I know they're not good, or they're not, or so as people say. And I do agree with that, but there are just those times where I get wrecked by black wings and I don't like it. And then I feel salty and it's annoying. And I hate when people call me salty. It's stupid and it's mean. Because then people like to call you bad, and then... You know, we're, we're just going to put Valor next to these two, because Valor is awesome. Even though it's terrible in the meta right now. It was being ran a little after Duel of Alliance was released, but then... Like, everyone dropped it. CG Catapult Dragon. Godder Damarug. Shieldwing. TG Striker. Odin, Father of the Azir. They, they just wanted to give me all of these for some reason. I don't know why. I didn't even want these. Drill Synchron. Bree Synchron. Nitro Synchron. Sun Dragon Inti. I probably should keep those all in my hand. Alright guys, the, the final pack of Destiny in which we know they're not going to give us that Vanity's Emptiness. Can we get it anyway though? Probably not. Because it's hard to pull. It's the sixth sense of this set. Except not banned. And completely counters the meta. Ah, jeez. Long. Don't have much time. Alright. Creation Resonator. Will Joel Sath and Nordic Alphair. Spear Force. Violet Witch. Blackwing Bore the Spear. Blackwing Armor Master. Fuck, no vanity's empty, but it's okay. Mechalode Factory. Urgent Tuning. Avenging Night Parshath. I probably shouldn't drop these. But anyway, guys. That's Legendary Collection. That's Legendary Collection uh, 5Ds. I hope you guys get luckier than I did and actually pull that Vanity's Emptiness because if you get that, cha ching, cha ching. Uh, make, and make it rain with money. Because that card. That card is expensive. And you want to sell that thing as quick as possible. Unless, of course, you're going for. Um, you're gonna make like a meta deck. I personally am not because you know I didn't get the suitable pulls for it. Also, after making a mermail deck, I don't really want to do that. But anyway, guys, thank you all for watching and bearing the sadness that I didn't get Vanity's empty. Well, I mean, you probably don't care that I didn't get Vanity's emptiness, but I do, and. Thank you guys, but thank you guys for watching this anyway, and supporting me, and uh, this, pro this will be the last video I record on Christmas, because, well, I don't have enough time, I don't have enough recording time on a flip camera to record another opening. And I have another, I have another set here, looking at it right now, but I'm not going to tell you guys what it is. And it's not shitty, it's actually good. I got good sets for Christmas this year, guys. Not any of those shitty sets. 
So, anyway, guys, thank you for watching, even though I didn't pull any, anything too good. I'd say Anturia Beast is the best thing I got. But, you know, I mean, we got the Quasar, the Black Rose, and Valor. And those are always cool. Of course, two of those being promos, but, you know, they're guaranteed. So, anyway, guys, I'll see you, I'll see you guys next time. Oh yeah, and uh, I just want to say, since since it'll be the last video I'm recording tonight, Merry. I hope you all had a Merry Christmas. Because I, I say that because I won't. I probably won't get this particular video up on Christmas, which is okay. But you know, just wanted to tell you guys. Hope you had a Merry Christmas. Hope you got presents, and. If you got coal, there is hope because coal can be sold for a lot of money. So, yeah. Don't let Santa Claus cheat you younger kids and don't be sad that you got coal. Be happy because then you can because then you can sell all your coal and get all the presents that you want anyway, guys. So, thank you guys for watching. Merry Christmas. I hope you had a happy holiday. I hope you had happy holidays for those of you who don't actually celebrate Christmas or Celebrate Christmas, either one. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys. In, I'll see you guys in another video.